Hey guys, Shala. We just got back from the grocery store and did the best grocery store haul of all time. Because we were out of town and had nothing. No food. So excited to share with you everything that's in our bags. Here we go. Romaine lettuce for lettuce wraps. Mm -mm -mm. Wait, you go and I go. Oh. One is right? Oh, go. Isn't that fun like that? Sure, go. Definitely subscribe to our channel for more content like this. <laughs> Actually, we've never done something like this. What's in your bags? Kale, I wish it wasn't in a plastic box. Agreed. Hummus. Homemade hummus is better. Unpack. More Unpack. greens. Bitchin' sauce. We're gonna make this. Pineapple for what? Jackfruit tacos? Jackfruit tacos, yeah. Thai rice. For what? For uh, spring rolls. What's this? Red cabbage? Mm -hmm. Purple cabbage? Purple. For spring rolls? Spring rolls and our detox salad. Yeah. Carrots? My turn. <laughs> Zucchinis, because we're making zoodles with kale pesto this week. Carrots in a bag Those for our detox awesome. salad. And for spring rolls, because I like to shave them instead of the pokey shreds, because they poke through the spring roll. You want like melt in your mouth carrots for spring rolls. Turn, whose turn is it? Mine. Bulk bin granola. In a plastic bag. Sorry, Atlantic Ocean. For but real. there's no way to buy it from the bulk section, not in a plastic bag. You know, we'll, we'll figure it out. Moving on. Cantaloupe. Mangoes. One for spring rolls, um, and one for cold brew. For cold brew. With water and almond milk. We forgot to say we go to two grocery stores. This is two grocery store haul. Yep. So some of it's Trader Joe's and some of it's brush time. Okay. My turn. Your turn. Apples. For what? And oranges for green juice. Okay. We make that every morning. And those are staples. Tortillas. Jackfruit tacos. And we make quesadillas a little. Um, yellow squash for, we're making fajita bowls this week. Sugar snap peas. Spring rolls. Lemon and lime go in like every smoothie and juice we make. We got basil. I wish we had a plant, but we face east and we can't keep any plants alive. Your turn. Carrots, because we have them every week for our queso. Celery for Same. just crudettes. Crud crudettes. Uh, yellow onion for our fajita bowls. Green onion for spring rolls. Mm -hmm. Sweet potatoes, we just like to have on hand. That's kind of a pantry item for us and we make them for the baby. And also, you don't have to put things in a plastic bag when you're there. Do you That's see right. how everything's like loose? This yeah. would be- I'll put a picture of our cart. Our cart was loose full yeah. of this wonderfulness. I mean, you have to wash stuff better when you get home, but it saves a lot of plastic. Cucumber for crudettes. Speaking of wasted plastic. I know, I hate this. Your turn. Broccoli, crudette, water chestnuts. That's one of the main ingredients for the um, lettuce wraps. It's like a little crunch. Bananas for everything. For everything. <laughs> More bananas so for everything. Cilantro, also kind of for everything, but one of the main things is uh, spring rolls. And the jackfruit tacos. Mini tomatoes for dipping in everything. And our taco salad. And taco salad. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, with ranch dressing. Homemade right? Bubby's pickles, which we both love so much, but they're like crazy expensive and they were on sale, so we got them. They're the most similar to grandma's pickles that we make from scratch. Cauliflower for? Detox salad. Yeah. Lots of red peppers. Red pepper is the secret ingredient for our queso. And then also we're making those fajita bowls. We got other peppers this week too. Fajita we never bowls. get other peppers. Excited for those. Bloobs for smoothie bowls. Avocados because- Wait, I got avocados too. Plant it's like, based. It's like war. <laughs> Bananas and avocados are what every vegan needs. Okay. And make peace with avocados. Do we need to explain our house situation? We eat plant-based at home. Yeah, we have a vegan house. That's what we do. Lenny's a vegan and I am not outside of the house, but the household is. Yeah. Strawberries. Nom nom. <sighs> Chips for dipping in everything. Your turn. Well, My turn. All peppers. Bamba. This is bamba. Great for feeding babies and snacky wives. 
I love Bamba. She it's an Bamba. Israeli snack that's peanut based. And so you give it to babies so that they don't get peanut allergies, but also they're delicious. My turn. Okay, go. Almond milk, staple, Better. vanilla, and plain, both unsweetened. This is another thing that you can make homemade that we've made homemade. It's so much better homemade. And we have no excuse Sometimes for buying it. Yeah, it's, just, it's so much better homemade. Coffee because whole bean. whole bean coffee because fresh ground coffee is the best. More hummus. Again, mention. better homemade. This one pound plus of chocolate, dark chocolate. You eat it straight. That's for him, by the way. Most will, women are like the chocolate hounds in the house. Lenny will eat that whole thing. I'll eat the whole thing. That's on next week's grocery list too. <laughs> Tofu, that's the main thing in the lettuce wraps. That's like what makes the like chicken-y type. Yeah. Um, and we'll and cut up some rectangles for spring rolls too. Exactly. Okay, garbanzo beans. These are chickpeas. We can make our own hummus, feed the baby, put them on salads. We always have cans of chickpeas. Uh, garbanzo beans, chickpeas, at home. Um, soy chorizo, which is like the most delicious product, processed product you can buy. It's from Trader Joe's. It actually won the best meat category at Trader Joe's this year, even though it's soy based, not actual meat based. It's the best. It's very, very good. Black beans, because black beans. We needed to like actually stock our pantry this week, so we have black beans for. Mexican yeah, salad. Yeah, or if you're stuck with nothing, just nothing but rice. Add some black beans. What do we do with this? Coconut, that's for curries. Oh yeah. So we're not making curry favorite. this week, but it's good to have in the cabinet. Okay. And then mushrooms, that's the other main ingredient for the spring rolls. Oh, turmeric, great in juices, and it's like one of those super spices. And you use it every morning in your like, my water. My morning elixir. I, <laughs> I put like a, like a giant mason jar and add some. Do I want to say no? <laughs> Arabiata sauce. Arabiata sauce. Okay, another thing we've made homemade. It's yeah delicious. But, but sometimes we found one that's really really we're good. We're exhausted and we just want to dump a thing of pasta and a sauce. So this one's from Trader Joe's. Yeah. It's very good. Oh, my bags are empty. Well, I guess you'll have to just listen to me talk about yeah. peanut butter. Trying new salsas this week. Pretty much we all the things salsa. that we have here, we could make, and, and we do make, but sometimes we buy them. Corn for our Mexican salad. Obviously, fresh corn is in season, but I'd have to cook it, and our Mexican salad is something I make like for lunch, and there's no way I'm cooking corn for lunch. What else? Give me one to do. Ooh. Cowboy caviar. Ooh, this is a really good salsa. We actually looks like looking around. We have the ingredients to make salsa like mm -hmm. this. It's corn and beans and tomatoes and deliciousness. My favorite salsa ever. Cowboy caviar. What else? That's it. And then in the freezer. Oh. We already unloaded the freezer. Them? We do pizza night on Fridays. There's burger crumbles on the bottom. No, we'll skip the burger crumbles. Skip them. They're beyond meat burger crumbles. Oh, I'll get them. We do frozen pizza night on. Friday nights, and this is a cheeseless one. They do make vegan frozen pizzas. Like but this is the best one stuff. we found. This one's better. And then we add our own so delicious shreds. Which is the best um, plant-based cheese we've found. Should That's I get those too? No, we okay. didn't get them today. Oh, but they're in our drawer. But we didn't get them today, so you be blind. And last but not least, <laughs> this is something I take to our, our office, our conference room that we share and I call my office. They're like, they're like lean cuisines, but it's vegan tikka masala and it's the best. It's really good. It's not enough for lunch though. No, I could eat four of these <laughs> for sure. Okay, so so follow to recap, us to be able to- With all this, we're gonna make- Lettuce wraps, spring rolls, detox salad, cashew queso. Veggies with hummus on them. Veggies with hummus on them. Fajita bowls. Probably some pasta with red sauce smoothie bowls in like four weeks when we have zero food yeah when all this is gone that's when we use the pasta and red sauce a gazillion smoothie bowls lots of smoothie bowls and, and maybe a curry maybe because we have coconut milk yeah it's good to do this i like doing this it's fun do you? Do you like doing this? You just like attention i love attention but i like i like but this is inspiring to people 
inspired by eating an entire pound of chocolate. This is what we do. This is the realest of the real. It's true. This is legit everything we bought. We're not like hiding something in the back. No hiding. No hiding. Okay, on three, pick out your favorite thing and then we'll sign off. Ooh, that's so hard. One, two, three. <laughs> Fishing sauce. Bubby's pickles is what I'm most excited about. Like, I'm gonna open them right now. Okay, say thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys. <laughs>